y'all. Welcome back to the McFly Files, episode six. I missed you last week, um, but happy 20th, wicked, because that's what they celebrated on Broadway.com. I'm not offended. I do love Wicked. Anyways, we're back, and this is what I like. I think I'm gonna call it Press Week. We do press all the time, but we just have a lot of press coming up. We've got Comic Con, we got uh, a lot of stuff. Um, so it, we've also got some characters from maybe your favorite TV shows when you were a child. Just, just tune in. Here we are, Comic Con. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah, this guy seems ready. We got the whole gang here. Uh, almost all the principals, except for, uh, yeah. except for, except for Roger. Hey man, what's your name? Hi, I'm Kevin. I'm Marty McFly from 2015. Yes, you are, sir. Yes. Look at that, man. They light up. You like the show, man? I love it. You guys do a great job. Thank you so much, dude. Thanks for being here. Yeah! Almost Famous Show. Yeah. Dude, come on. Almost Famous Show merch. Yeah. And One of the best shows I've ever seen. One of the best shows you've ever yeah, seen? Yeah, yeah. Oh. I love that. I saw it twice. Oh, thank you, man. Yeah, then yeah. you got my fly in there. Yep. Cool, man. Appreciate you, man. Is that eel? Yeah. Amazing. That's so cute. How are you guys doing? Yeah, good. How are you doing? <laughs> Um, so at the very end, uh, I pan to a guy leaning up against a wall. That is John Carpenter. He wrote and uh, directed Halloween um, and uh, wrote the theme for it and also The Thing and Escape from New York. It's, I, I can't believe he's here. It's, it's incredible. Here we are. I do not have residuals in my time. Unfortunate. Yes. So how, how are you first supposed to? So, like Merritt, I... That's me. Uh, okay, here we go. Three, two, one! Can everyone say, great shot on three? Three, two, one! Right, folks so if you do not follow me on social media uh, then you would not know that I was on watch what happens live and that is a show hosted on Bravo by Andy Cohen and uh, I'll, I'll put a couple clips um right here hey y'all big surprise for y'all oh my goodness hey back to the future cast yes it's the HBIC right here yes <laughs> Basically, I was the bartender. I wasn't a guest on the show, but he asked me a couple questions. He like asked me about Michael J. Fox, and uh, you know, it was it was just really it was a fun experience. Basically, all I did was just stand behind a bar that wasn't real, by the way. There's no actual uh, alcohol behind the bar. Power of Love is playing in this Friedman's. Get away from it. You can run, you can hide. You can't get away from it. Oh, Hugh, hey, look, Hugh, that. Oh, wait. hello. That's I'm Hugh Goals. It's good to see you. Will, are you. I love acting and I love Back to the Future. <laughs> you wore his outfit and. Oh, yes. So I you're. Got, I got married to. Hugh, Hugh you're, you're George to, today, right? Oh, yes. I'm, I'm, George. I'm George every day. <laughs> Hey, what's hey. going on? Billy. Oh, this is my Halloween costume. I, I gotta stretch it out though, because I've grown a little bit since I last wore it. Oh, I'll be right back. <laughs> the vision in green. What's going on here? I'm obsessed with Kimmy Emanuel, and I wanted to match her since July when I found out she was my swing sister, and it's been um, how many months? That it took wow. me to yeah, a while. I love her. When, did um, you order these? Um, yeah, thank you, Asos. And they just came in? No, they came no, they in, in, in July. In July. <laughs> She's been planning this since July. And today is the day <laughs> yeah, you decided. We decided to be the Shining Twins. Well, <laughs> you look, come and play with, with us, us, Casey. Oh, I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Bye. By the way, that is the Sacred Heart of St. Patty Lapone. On the dress? Oh, yeah, her actual heart. 
How is she alive? Uh, Billy. What happened? What is this? Why? Ah! Ah! Is that you? Stop it! That's close. Stop quitting, my That's you. I'm Bat Boy's grandfather. <laughs> It is Back to the Future Day. We got Brandon. Brandon, <laughs> you've been calling the show a lot recently. It's been <laughs> amazing. You, uh, when you're not it interrupting was, me. Yeah, oh! so, sorry. It's Back to the Future Day, which means that October 21st is the day that everyone traveled back in time. Uh, it, actually, to the future in the second movie, and now it is a national holiday. And today we have very special guest, the original Marvin Berry from the movie Back to the Future. <laughs> Harry Waters, Harry Waters Jr. Jr. Good afternoon. We have bad lighting behind us. Oh my gosh. Hi, we can actually see each other. Uh, yes, How yes, yes. How are you all doing? Oh my gosh. So what did we just do, Harry? It was, we had an amazing magic moment on stage here at the Winter Garden that I got to actually sing a duet of Earth Angel with Jelani. It was so much fun. It was, and the audience standing and screaming. It was it, one of the best moments I think I've ever had in my career. Just watch it, because I was right in the middle of you guys, and the light was shining on you both. We were seeing each other's faces. It's just amazing, man. You still and got it. it. And, it and it was great just being in that energy of this show with the people so much love. Oh my God, I'm humbled by all y'all, and I still get to do this. So thank you thank so you much. Thank you so much for being really here. good, too. Hey! Oh, appreciate you, man. <laughs> Because it's Back to the Future Day, oh, of yeah. course you know who's here. Bob Gale, co-writer of the movie and the musical. Thank you for being here, my friend. I'm always happy to be here. I'm at my happiest when I'm here at the Winter Garden Is this Garden your favorite Theater. day uh, every year, Back to the Future Day? Well, no, my wife's birthday. Oh, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes, of course, of course. But probably your favorite holiday, right? Well, yeah, oh, absolutely. It's incredible. How Thank could you. it not be? Thank you for being here. What a great moment we just had. It was fabulous. It was fabulous. We did, we did something like this in London last year, and it was so much fun, and it was so great. I said, let's do it here. It happen every year. It's awesome. Great. Out of the door. All right, it's been a while. Oh, super zoomed. <laughs> All right, it's been a while since we che since we uh, checked in on everyone in the cast. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and check on and check in on everyone real quick. Jelani. Ah! Oh, don't barge in on me like that. I thought you were Liza Minnelli. You, you thought I was Liza Minnelli? Ah! Liana, look at you, looking camp right in the eye. There it is. Oh my gosh. Oh, there you are with your drink. Wait, is there anything in that? No, I just like to look at it and have it nearby. All right. So we just had a big sickness go around called the Broadway cough, and I'm gonna just check on the swings. They, they were on a lot. Hey guys, hey, are you all right? Is everyone all right? Oh, 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 oh. This is not a bit. I literally <laughs> just walked in. <laughs> this is not We're planned. We're editing our stories. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, can I see this video? <laughs> signing Our the goal. legacy robe. As long, just don't sign in the marked off right spot. Did you sign, Chase? Yeah, yeah. yeah. He did, right, right, right there. Nice. Right Take there. me up. Mm. Take me All right, folks, that is the end of episode six of the McFly Files. I will see you once again next week. Thank you so much for tuning in for this jam-packed episode. Whoa, what an episode has been. Uh, I love you all deeply, and I'm out of time. See you all next week.